Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I have a mess going on. This is kind of a combination vlog. This is kind of get ready with me for my birthday, which is my 41st birthday. Also, um, this is my first time flying. So I'm gonna vlog my experience. I'm only going to Atlanta, which is like five hours away from me. Therefore, if I'm too frightened to get back on the plane, I can drive back home. But I'm gonna go over the things that I'm packing. I'm probably gonna leave out some things because again, this is my first time flying. I try to read up on it, do my little research on the things that I can and cannot have. But before I go any further, I want you guys to hit that subscribe button, um, hit like and the notification bell and follow along. First thing first, I realized that I did not have a luggage. I mean, I normally go, when I go someplace, I only pack enough, you know, for that weekend or whatnot. And I usually use the little bags that you get free when you purchase $75 worth of items in pink or Victoria's Secret. Those are the bags that I normally travel with. So I had to go and buy me a luggage. So it has the little wheels on it and it has a lot of little pockets. I got this from Ross for only $21. I was going to get the hard kind. But I figure I, I'm not really going to have anything that's too fragile in here. And I didn't feel like spending 50, 60 bucks. So that's the first thing. Then I have my, my little travel case. So I have some things in here. My lotions and my body wash. Okay, so I'm going to speed things up. I have all of my travel utensils, such as my deodorant, toothpaste, toothbrush. I have my containers to put my lotions and, you know, body wash in. Um, then I have some, you know, a few items of clothing. I have these shirts for me, my mom, and my daughter. Um, it's just God. We're going to dress alike. We were going to wear it on the plane, but I think it's going to be too cold for that. Um, then I have my Nike outfit. I have some shoes. I have, of course, some jeans because I'm a jean type of girl. I have my scarf and glove because my mom said it's going to be about 20 degrees in Atlanta. So I'm, I'd rather be safe than sorry. Um, you know, my Nikes. I have this shirt that I purchased um, for my birthday. It's called um, Thick Thighs and patience because you know a girl is sexy at 41 um you know i might try to step out a little bit i got i don't really wear heels but i did want to wear something casual and then what else do i have of course the accessories to go along with it Then I have my pillow. You know, they say get your pillow so your neck can be comfortable while on the plane. Hey, I don't know. I just grabbed that just in case. And then over here, I have a few other clothing items, you know, just in case. Plan B. I have this little halter top shirt, this little dress with the slit that comes up. Another little sweatsuit from pink you know just in case you know girl can never have too many clothes and yeah that's about it so that's about it as far as what i'm taking with me now you know i'm a natural so i have a little style in mind that i'm gonna attempt to do hopefully it come out right but right now i've been natural for what, four years so I'm pretty confident if if it, if the style doesn't come out, I'm able to do something with my hair that's presentable. I'm not worried about that. But yeah, we'll be doing something with that. So I'll let you know. I'll vlog that as well. But see you later. All right. Get ready to catch our shuttle to the airport. Am I scared? Mm, we'll see a little bit. Okay, on a scale, on a scared o meter. Right now, I say on a scale of one through ten, I'm about a two. Right now, I'll keep you posted. Well, y'all. Hmm. 
Okay, let's figure out where we're supposed to go at. <laughs> now he know he was supposed to put that windshield wipe on home before he left the house. Especially if he knew it was really not there. All right. <laughs> So the first mishap is the shuttle guy came to pick us up from the house and it was raining and then we hear a pop. So his windshield wiper broke on the van and it's the driver's side. <laughs> so that took my scared meter from two to about four. But luckily, we only live about five, six minutes from the airport. So it wasn't that scary of a drive. But he knew he was, he, and then when we got out, he said, okay, I'm going to go ahead and switch it. He was supposed to switch it before he left the house. Don't play in my face. What did I say? Jacksonville with this rain going on. We've asked our flight attendants to stay in their seats. Probably going to be a little bit bumpy on the climb out. We ask that you do the same. Keep those seatbelts fastened. Once we get up to a cruise altitude, it should be a much better ride on the way to Atlanta. And uh, we'll just see how much time we've got left. See if the flight attendants have enough time to do a service. So we appreciate your patience with that. Hopefully they can get it out. If not, we do apologize in advance. Latest weather up there in Atlanta. A little bit better than it is here. Not a whole lot. They've got... Uh, Overcast skies, light rain, temperature 44 degrees Fahrenheit. Thanks for coming out and flying with us today. Welcome aboard. We'll be underway shortly. Somebody's going to be bumping. I already feel the bumps. No, he done turned on the head. Like and this is it. Jesus. This is not a test. Are you here? If you are here, I'll see you. 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 I'll see you.